All right, guys, so let's take a look here at a concept that, you know, the old Chargers team used to run under uh, offense coordinator Frank Reich and kind of compare it to something that we kind of saw last year uh, with a promising young player in, in Paris Campbell. So here I want to highlight this play, especially one because, you know, I, I saw it in a video, uh, actually an interview with, with Colts' current offense coordinator Nick Sirianni. He brought up this play when talking about what the Colts want to do on their offense. You know, they want to get the ball – to their playmakers within that five yard of the line of scrimmage. So right in this area right here is where the Colts want to get uh, the ball to their playmakers. And this is a great example of Tyrell Williams uh, just taking the ball here within the first five yards and going for a score. Tyrell Williams is a great player, uh, really fast guy, and, and this is what they used. They kind of used him a lot for this role here uh, in that 2016 season when, when Coach Reich and, and Sirianni were both there. Uh, but look at this play here. You can see uh, all these players right here are clearing out for Williams to take this ball and, and get down the sideline. The big thing that Sirianni was bringing up in that interview was the ability to make that one defender miss. You know, once you get to this spot right here, it's a foot race and just beating this guy right here. And that's exactly what they're trying to do with this play. When they're isolating him, bringing him across the formation like this, you're really just saying, okay, try to catch this guy right here. And the Colts really have, you know, a couple players on the roster that can do stuff like this. You know, Marcus Johnson we saw a little bit last year. Uh, T.Y. Hilton obviously can can do this as well uh, as Williams is able to finish for the score. Uh, but I want to look at Paris Campbell here on a play from last year. And this is actually a little bit different of a concept. You know, we got Paris Campbell down here on the bottom of the screen. We actually have trips at the top here. And this is actually going to be the Colts' standard mesh uh, mesh play. Uh, Doyle's going to come around right here, kind of sit in the middle. And that's the typical read on these mesh routes. You know, you're going to have the action going back and forth, and you're going to have Doyle sitting right here uh, for that easy, you know, seven, eight-yard gain. Uh, but Campbell kind of gets lost in the traffic here and he, as he's coming up the field. And you can kind of see right here he gets lost in the traffic. Uh, and they're able to dump it down. And the big thing that Campbell's able to do is he's able to make that one defender miss. And once he makes that one defender miss, he's off to the races up, up the sideline. Now, obviously, you like to see him finish this play. He fumbles before he gets to the end zone here. Uh, but I think this is definitely a way that the Colts can not only help Phillip Rivers next year and, and kind of get the ball quick out of his hands and get to these playmakers, but also a way that the Colts can really get Paris Campbell involved in this offense and get him to kind of reach that next level of his game where we saw, you know, an inconsistent rookie his rookie year. Now we can see, you know, maybe a year or two jump from this guy if we're able to get him the ball in space like this. Because like Sirianni said, uh, get the ball to your playmakers within that five yards of line of scrimmage. Sometimes get them uh, those catch and run situations and they can make plays happen just like this. And, you know, I think uh, obviously Tyra Williams able to finish this play. I think, you know, we can see the same thing from Paris Campbell here in year two if, you know, he's able to put it all together and the Colts really are, you know, able to draw up some plays for him like this.